checking, checking. Checking, checking. Why does it say I'm offline? Okay, I'm on. Why does it say I'm off? Okay, we got sound. We got sound. All right, cool. Okay, I'm on. Why does it say I'm off? Okay, we got sound. We got sound. All right, let's try this again. All right, the game was being stupid. Now I yes yes Zach it was all you it, it was all you why why would you do such a thing why in God's good green earth why would you cause my computer which obviously you have never touched seen or looked at in a unchristian way to screw up all right so. I mean, I'll just keep playing this, honestly, until, like, around, uh, 8.30 or, uh, oh, that's only 10 minutes away. Okay, let, let's go to 9. Let's see, let's see how far we can do this. I really want to see Mr., uh, Mr. Dashing, Mr. Dapper. Um, okay. Alright, here we were again! For me, the sound is cutting in and out again. Let me know if the sound goes out. Okay. Now let's figure out where the hell I have to go. I guess maybe I went the wrong way? Yeah. Yeah, it, it's definitely cutting in and out for me. I don't know why. So weird. I wonder if it's my headphones. Or if it's not it's not blocking it out when I talk. So why do I keep coming back here? Well, there's no other place for me to go. I can't jump up there. I think I have to get up there. But I'm not sure how. Or this is just an indie game and the sound may not be the best quality. Okay, I guess that just opened the door. Yes, it did. Huh. Might be just a soundtrack or something that's cutting in and out. Yeah, I guess it's just a soundtrack. Oh, sorry for the weird kind of ambient hum in the background. Um, my room gets very hot. <laughs> uh, my room gets very hot, and uh, unfortunately I have to have a fan going much of the time. <laughs> it just said you started watching. <laughs> Okay, I guess I go this way. Uh... Fudge! Oh! Okay. I... Hi there! I'm sorry if I missed your jump scare. I'm, I'm sure it was really good. I'm sure you put a lot of effort and time into that. 
Ow. You know, this guy's bare feet, that has to be bad on it. Has to be. Okay. Uh, and I think we lost Katie. Um... Let me just message her real quick. Stream still going. Yeah, I I mean that's what I would do, honestly. I mean, he has a good he has a good spot. Uh, I really don't want to use the camera because I can't see as well with the camera. Oh, he didn't have anyone to spot him. Uh, I should probably close. <laughs> yeah, the audio is like really slow. It's Tweedledee and Tweedledick! Hey guys! Oh my god, I've missed you! Oh! I'm so glad you guys are here and showed up. I hope you have a good time. I really do. Go get them, boys. Go get them. Ooh, that's why you have somebody spot you at all times. He did poor... Poor weightlifting etiquette. See, now after playing the game, I'm more than excited. Oh, hey, Katie! Oh, hey! Look! And Tweedledee and Tweedledick are back! How you guys doing? You're just gonna slowly follow me, aren't you? I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run. Oh. Well, you didn't make it far. Oh! Hey, guys. How's it hanging? Oh. Uh. Ow. Fuck you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going. Yeah, well, they're here. I, I don't know if it's just a cameo, but they didn't attack me, which is weird. They said they wanted my skin or liver or... Hmm. Open door on the other side. Great. Why does it make me go the other side? Oh, hey! The Wall Rider Delusion. Kurt, we've got another one. I'm not sure we're going to be able to check it off as psychosomatic, psychosomatic proximity disorder. Security guard all the way up in the admin block is our latest non-patient employee to start seeing Ven Vernicke's fairy tales. He was never directly exposed to the engine. Never even made it below level one in the building. It would be an enormous breach of protocol and security if doctors were speaking of the wall rider within hearing distance of, and seems vanishingly improbable that he would stumble onto such a obscure mythological story of its own. I really want to check and Google that if wall rider is like a real thing because we know uh, it It was connected with uh, uh, the, 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 the hags, the old hags of legend of like uh, sleep paralysis of waking up and feeling like something sitting on your chest. Uh, it's too similar to Dr. Samuel Case or the others before him. It's one thing for formerly sane medical personnel to fall under the delusion of their patients. It's another thing entirely for those beliefs to be, I don't know, airborne. We need to talk in per person, Billings. Hmm. Right then. I guess... Where do I go? Oh, this way. Like, it seems... I mean, from from the from the actual game, they seem to associate it with like uh, the nightmares or the succubi, like waking up and. What are they running away from? Do I want to climb the ladder? Oh yeah, I'm back here. Cool. 
Hmm. Well, they empty their trash. That's good. Again, this way? No. Gotta keep climbing the ladder, I guess. <sighs> See, I'm waiting for that jump scare where you're They'll just... tell you it's science... Not. They were waiting for us in this place. Billy understood. They've always been here. Yeah, well, fuck Billy. Okay, you're still there. Good. One day I'll find something in these besides. All right then. Oh. This is not a good place to be. Closing this door. Okay, so what's gonna screw me over? What's gonna screw me over when I go to use this radio? What's Called it! Oh, it's the douchebag! Oh, you fucking douchebag. I kinda wanna keep playing this game to watch him die in a cathartic way. You couldn't just... You couldn't just keep your mouth shut. You couldn't just play along. But you're done talking now. Do me a favor and die here. Is that Mr. Smiles? Well, there goes that plan. Oh. I think that. Oh my god, it is Mr. Smiles! Yep! Hey, Mr. Smiles! Good to see ya! Everybody, let's give a hand for Mr. Smiles! Oh, fuck you, man. He's. he's done. I got no idea where I'm going. Ugh. Woo Go faster! Go faster! Awesome! Ha! Attention, work personnel. An emergency evacuation is <laughs> No. Patients and are advised to remain calm in their room until the Wasn't that Isaac Clarke's Laws or whatever? Or, uh, oh, it's some famous sci fi guy. Another poor soul. <gasps> Father O'Brien O'Reilly O'Connor or. Whether you know it or not. It's just a rogues gallery! Oh man! Oh, I know where I am. Oh, this is like. Oh, this is the thing at the end of the game. Oh, wow! I ah, just bring back so many good memories. Seeing the whole crew again. Somebody who looks much as a priest is this place. Asylum, writing instructions on the wall. God. Human bullshit, greed, real genocide, ripped from tortured minds. The links of their jack booted business school worms. Uh, Jack booted business school worms will go to to protect it. Their own men slaughtered. I've never prayed in my life, Lisa. But if some small minded interventionist god is still lowercase, that's bad grammar. Kill Jer Jeremy Blair before I die. Sanity and avarice. There's no pain he doesn't deserve. <laughs> There's no radio. Oh, reaching the outside world. Only escape. Yeah, that's right, you heard me. I'm gonna read those notes in a different accent every time. Ooh. 
Just carried profit. Rick, fun hitting the greens last week. We should make a drive more often. <laughs> Fuck you. I was reviewing some old test records from the early days of Project and something, Spark my age. Following the project back in 2010, apparently we had issues with female employees experiencing psychosomatic pregnancies. Uh -huh. Something to do with the morphogenic engine interacts with the immune system. All agree to me. Am I right? Holtz. Uh, uh, it was more often fatal than not, and these were employees and not patients. So a little harder to sweep on the rug. But morphogenic activity, these marrow, was off the charts. And these are women who were never exposed to additional hormone therapy. Now, I don't know PPM from a kick in the teeth, but I can read a spreadsheet, and if the project profits from Project Wall Rider are half what they say they are, I've just got one question. Why aren't we performing experiments on women? God knows mental illness is equal opportunity affliction. Seems unethical to pass up on such a potential windfall. Jer- Oh my god. Oh my- Wow. I- I cannot wait for this guy to get us- Come up and. I've been in here before. Oh, good. Some place to hide. Which means I'm gonna be running away from something again. Seems to be my lot in life. Alright. Oh, shit. I wonder what I look like. Oh, that'd be interesting. That'd be interesting that I look like so monstrous to them. Oh, that'd be so cool. Yeah, I've been here. Oh, another battery. Yep. So, I was addicted to the other guy in the main game by stealing his batteries. Uh, Mr. Smiles. Oh, hey, Mr. Smiles. How you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you want to eat my marrow. Suck it dry. Yeah, this is completely dark. Out those pixie goes. Through the door. Through the windows. Wow, this load... That loading thing is, like, really jarring. The other game didn't have... Yeah, I know. It's like frickin'... Oh, I guess I don't need that. That was clearly open! Maybe it's like chained or something. Like a... wall rider? Huh? Trees are speaking, they're speaking my name. They say things to me and I say things back. They say, how you doing? How you doing, my boy? I say I'm doing fine. Would you come back to me? Gosh darn it, where the heck do I go? Oh, there's a window. Hey, buddy. I'm just gonna grab this. Doesn't seem like you need it. The groom. Above the knees, below the navel. Slice and stone on Glustic's table. To make a place to push inside, the groom will make himself a bride. There, yes! The groom! That guy! Ah! He's coming! Make himself a bride. Above the knees, below the navel. Okay. So he's gonna make himself a bride. Alright. This is gonna be... Buddy? Oh, I guess the door is open now. Maybe? That one's not open. That one's not open either! What the heck? 
I am most disappointed. Huh. Do I climb up somewhere? Hmm. Well, obviously somebody was playing with me. Just playing games. Playing with my noggin. Playing, playing. Playing player. Playing with the plays. The plays the thing. By which we'll catch the conscience of a king. Okay, dude, you came from somewhere. Where did you go? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? I'm missing something. And it's gonna, like, hit me like a ton of bricks. Or, like a giant fat man with a big smile on his face. Hmm. Well, obviously they want me to come back out through this way. Okay, I did that. Can't go that way. Is there another window I'm supposed to go into? You know, Zach, it's like it's like you almost want me to be scared. It's weird. And I just used another fucking battery! Okay. Hmm. Okay, you came from somewhere. Is there, like, a place I'm supposed to dig under? Over? Hmm. Oh. Really? Wow. Okay. Okay. Come on and knock on my door. I've been waiting for you. I know, I know it's a song. Am I supposed to turn this? I don't know. Every time I found a valve, I'm supposed to turn it. I feel kind of bad leaving that thing unturned. Oh. Coming from this way. Oh, really? I can't pass through. Oh, battery. Thank you. Oh, you're dead. Okay. Well, thanks for the battery. At least you died. You died as you lived. Sitting against a wall, taking a break. Lazy bastard. Okay, it's a nice storeroom. Nice, uh, nice, good, sturdy storeroom. Oh, document. Share me your secrets. Kill us. Kill us. Burn the building. Worse than death here. Kill us. Kill us. All right then. Oh gosh, that's not gonna be good. Okay, well that's locked. Good. That's locked. Good. Oh, I guess there's somebody being electrified in there? Man, it would've been nice if I had seen it! That's where I came from. Okay, there we go. Ow! Fuck! Alright then. I'm going to have to... figure out how to de-electrify this thing. Uh Can I just hear a helicopter? Hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, half this game is me being absolutely terrified, half this game is me having no bloody idea where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. Yep, those are live wires. Let's let's not touch those. <sighs> Obviously, that's a door I have to go in. I think. 
is that's locked. That's locked and electrified, so I can't go that way. Uh Yeah, obviously can't go that way. Uh, yeah, this this is nothing. This place is useless. Uh Hmm. Can I climb a tree? Do I try the door again? <sighs> yes. Yeah, but I think the switch is like on the other side of this thing. That's the thing. Oh, the switch. See, that looks like the switching station over there. But I need to be able to get over or around this thing. So, hmm, hmm, hmm. I need to go through the building. I'm gonna like shoot myself if this was actually a thing and this was the place I was supposed to go in. That's locked. That's that, that, that's nothing. Hmm. Oh, wait. Oh! Wow, I am an idiot. Quick, darling, in the closet. Honey, oh no, that's that's not nice. Shocker. Is that Mr. Yes, he was jerking off. Yes, he was. He was a real jerk off. So, question. If I just turned off all that power, why are there still lights? Somebody just turned it back on. Burning lights. The power's still on. Electricity. I need to think, Lisa. Thought the power was evidence of some manageable, some human force still controlled some part of the Mount Massive, but nothing human or sane can do anything here but survive. Even that, not for long. If you were always reasonable, one read Lisa. You would always tell me to calm down, to take a larger view. Rule this place. Whatever is keeping the electricity flowing here is trying to trap me here. I need to shut it down again? Yeah, I do. And that's what the stupid things are going to be for. Yeah, yeah, so what's there waiting for me? Oh, that's new. Yeah, he's not jerking off there anymore. He's gonna be right behind me. Fuck you! Yeah, call that fucker. Get out of here. Haha! <laughs> oh my god! They've learned how to open doors! They're smarter than Velociraptors! See, at least all he's gonna do is punch me to Which is, in the grand scheme of things, not that frightening. Oh! Never mind! Yes, this is the way I'm gonna go. Wall Rider's here. I smell him. Do you smell Wall Rider? He smells like daisies. Okay, good. Good. Now I'm really in the shit. What the fuck? Is that Wall Rider?
Okay, wall rider. Why are you doing this? Thought we were friends. Thought we were good friends. Oh! I'm back here. Oh! Easy way out. It would be so easy. I don't believe in it anymore. Getting the truth out. There is no truth. Only lies. We've accepted too long to double back on. It's our children, Lisa. I would take the easy way out if it wasn't for the boys. Damn this place to hell. I'll suffer anything to get out of it. <laughs> Ooh, this looks charming! I would like to make a loft apart of this place. You did. Well, I'm gonna close the door so I don't let a draft in. There's gonna be a thing I'm gonna have to jump over, isn't there? His feet have to be cut to heck and back, and so infected too. There's a ladder. Mm, oh, that wasn't a ladder. Okay. You know, I'm glad we saw Tweedledee and Tweedledick, but I kind of miss them. I don't do. So, I guess I'll take the way out that that guy did. Just jump. Just jump. This place is actually really huge. I never realized that. Alright, let's do this! Woohoo! You can do it! Ouch. Well, I guess you couldn't do it. I really had such high hopes in you. As long as the camera survived, you're fine. Okay, why are you acting like that? So, suddenly we're in... Oh, I do have the camera! What the heck? Great, now I have hillbillies to worry about. fuck is going on here? Some weird shit, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, Clem. I'm telling you. Oh. Groom? Oh, do we finally get to meet the groom? Oh, that'd be so cool. I've been waiting for him. Here comes the bride, she's out of her freaking mind. Oh. Black and sad, like the harder I try to escape the demon I get. Dead men aren't a surprise anymore. Suicide seems wise. Oh, is that the groom though? Except he's, I'm going to turn around and he's not going to be there. <sighs> Fuck you. If they catch us. It was to him, the man downstairs, 
Groom, I don't know who he is. Like, I well, one, he's a character who you saw being put in the uh, the Morphogenic engine right at the beginning of the game. Um, but I've seen a lot, like, when this DLC first came out, um, there was a lot of, like, fan art of him. Apparently, like, a lot of girls liked him or whatever. I, I don't get it. I don't get the opposite gender at all. Oh! Kill the rats! He's here! Inside the walls! Kill him! Oh shit. A little bit faster, please. Okay. Did I just. Ah, oh, fuck. What? Did I just, like, back myself into a corner or something? Or was I supposed to go the other way? I don't think there are any women in this place. I think they just... I think these are guys. I think these are just really messed up guys. I think this is one guy. I think this is all one guy making this voice. That would be awesome. Did I just... Ah, fuck, did I just go the wrong way? Oh. There he is. What do you think? See, told you. you yeah, see, it's one guy. It's one guy. <laughs> That's awesome. G Bravo, dude. Bravo. one guy. That's so cool. Weak. Give him to the groom. Ah, fuck. <laughs> Ow! Ah, crap. I don't know how to get out of here. Oh, there we go. Cool. Up, 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 up! You're just gonna open that door, right? Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Those are breasts sewn. Man's body mutilated and bent to mimic or mock the moment of birth. Kind of thing man cannot see without changing some irreparable way. Lisa, I was with you on both that boat. It was, until recently, the most miraculous thing I had seen. Completely outside of reasonable belief, and yet somehow central to everything I've come to believe since. You always said I was too literal a monster. Tried to turn everything into a if statement. Lately I've widened my horizons. How can the things I see here be? But I know the answer. Money. Things were made just because we could. Well, I guess this is the groom then. Uh, 
Okay. Sir? Are you alright? Uh, what time is it? Sorry. Well, I think we will call the night. Um, thank you for joining me, uh, Zach. Um, sorry for Katie. Um, uh, hopefully... Yeah, yeah, I know. That, that was messed up. So, I'm not sure... Uh... Oh, Katie, did you just get back on? Oh, oh my god, Katie. I'm sorry, you missed... Oh, you missed something truly, truly wonderful. In the complete opposite sense of the word. Oh. Uh, oh, well, I'm sorry you just made it back on, Katie. I was actually about to turn in for the night. So, uh, but thank you for coming. I appreciate you being here. In spirit. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys, and you have a good night.